Okay, so this is a screencast for a technical issue for an end user on forums.autodesk.com. The request is on how to use the yes no parameter within a window <clears throat> and nested families. See, here I have a standard Revit architectural template file project. All I have in it is a standard generic wall, and I've created a window that has two types one called glazing with ventilation and one called glazing without ventilation. So the first one on my left is the one that shows with ventilation. The one on my right shows without ventilation. How did I build this family? If I select the family and click edit family, uh, you will see that it is a standard uh, window family file. And if we look at the plan view, you have your standard wall, you have the opening, uh, all the defaults that came with the standard window family template file. There are two families in here that are nested. One is called generic without uh, glazing without ventilation, and one is called glazing with ventilation. So if you look under here, I just started with a generic model. If we want to, we'll just head over to that and let's look at glazing with ventilation. We'll right click and we'll click edit. <clears throat> and in here, it's nothing more than an extrusion that has a V cut into, so it's you know easily visible that this is the one that's ventilated. If we look at the front elevation, it has <clears throat> standard width and height. We go to a plan view, it has thickness. This is very, very simple. We take this, we save this, we load it back into the Revit window family file. And here we are glazing with ventilation. Uh, if I select it, uh, let's go ahead and close that. I head back over to the uh, window file that has that particular family nested into it. <clears throat> There's another one that's glazing without ventilation. And we, we go to it and look at its family we will see the front elevation shows the same thing. The plan view shows the exact same thing. <clears throat> the only difference between the glazing with and without ventilation is graphically, so you can just easily denote it and see it. Once those two family files are created, they are loaded into the window family file, and they're placed in the correct position. The way the, if we go in here under family types, you will see I created two family types, one for glazing with ventilation and one for glazing without ventilation. If I switch for glazing with ventilation, you will see down here under other, I created a couple of parameters called glazing with ventilation and that's a yes no parameter that is checked. If I switch this to glazing without ventilation, then the one that is glazing with ventilation will be unchecked and the one without ventilation will be checked. How does this get tied to back to the actual nested families? If I select any one of those nested families, this one says glazing without ventilation, head over to the visibility parameter under instance parameter, <clears throat> click this little button here that allows you to associate family parameters, and you will see I created a family parameter that is a yes no called glazing without ventilation. So if I want to create another parameter that is a yes, no, I can click add parameter. <clears throat> because we selected this little box here for uh, visibility, it's going to automatically default, uh, default as common discipline and a yes, no parameter. And we can name it whatever we want. So I had already created it and called it glazing without ventilation. Um, I do that for both families, <clears throat> both nested families. And once I've set those parameters here, I created the family types to show or not show the check mark that I want. Once that family is finished and created, I load it back into the project. And that way, when you are back inside the project, you can select a family. You can select the window. So I'll just expand this for a second. And I'll go over here and I'll create another one that's similar and another one here that's similar. And if I select this window family, I could just switch it now from glazing with ventilation to glazing without ventilation. So that's how the yes, no parameter functions. It's basically an on off switch. Most people will use it in combination with family types window because they'll have multiple
types of families that need to display or not display certain data. All right, I hope this helps. Thank you.